So to start this butterfly painting, I painted the background green with a one inch bright brush and I painted it vertically and I just kind of added some more white, yellow, blue, or brown in different areas to make it a little more interesting. So after my background was dry, I drew my grass and my butterfly with some white chalk and then I started painting in my grass. So there's some lighter grass in the back, so I added more white to that part and then the actual blade of grass that the butterfly is sitting on, I did a little darker. Now I'm going to fill the butterfly in with some white, put the white where I want the butterfly to be, and then I'm going to put some blue in the areas that are more blue. So I added some darker areas to the body and the wing of the butterfly and now I'm adding some details to the back wing. So I'm adding more detail in the wing that's in front now. So I did a darker line around the edge and then I did a, a few lighter lines that are coming down 
And I also put a little bit more blue on the wing. And now I'm wiping off the chalk lines with my rag and some water. Here I'm doing some dots with some black and blue. So I go in with the darker color first and then I go back over with the blue. And then I go into the part of the wing that's more gray and do some light lines to kind of make it look a little fuzzy with some blue and some gray. Now I'm adding some white spots with my small round still. And I'm also adding some black around the edge of the wing and also in the middle of each white spot. Now I mix up some orange with my red and yellow and put it under the black spots that I put around the edge of the wing. And then I go back in with black and put that under the orange. paint in the legs with white and black and some blue later on and then I go back and do some white and blue with my filbert granier and give the body some more fuzzy texture. Now with the face, I put some fuzziness with some white, blue, and black, and I also did the eye with black, and I put some white around it. And I'm going back and doing some details on the legs, and I also put some little black stripes on the legs too. So now I'm going in with some black and putting the lines coming off of his head and then I go back in and put some white stripes on that as well. So now you'll see me signing my painting and wiping off the rest of the chalk marks. So I hope you enjoyed this video and please give it a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.